guys this is Kailash and in this video we will try to install latest Android for Xperia C5 Ultra Dual so what you have to do to check is it available version for your device or not you have to get your USB data cable after installing PC suite on your system you just connect to it your phone like I am connecting so after connecting it will show your device is locked make sure your device is unlocked now right now I'm doing unlock of my device like that oh sorry okay once device is unlocked it will show you what kind of software is available for your device so new software version is uh, new software update available new version that's the version latest android software for the sony is available xperia device so it will get you very good performance and your device will work very smooth so to do this this task you have to just click on update pop-up on your system and it will ask you the latest version of device uh, for your device will download to your computer once download is complete you can process to your Xperia right so for my Xperia C5 Ultra Dual I will be looking for to get little software okay once I do okay so in the right top of the corner you will see the downloading software update so that indicates what percent download is completed right now it is maybe one or two percent so once that download is completed you are ready to go and you are ready to install your latest operating system with your latest port the download is completed right now after completing the download i am seeing the one dialog box and some expedia one minute it's getting some blood Yes, XP update will be installed latest software, latest system software on your device. Okay, so that is the version. So this technique will applicable for all Xperia devices. If you have Xperia C4, C5, C12, or any Xperia Z, Z1, or any Xperia device which you have, it can be used the same process to update the operating system. So let's get started. So at the bottom there is one important notice for you guys, we will go through that. So that notice is important, look at this, it, it strongly recommended that you keep your computer plugged in power source while updating, oh, sorry while updating, please make sure to make the backup of your data before starting that. Okay. So it is saying that you should have backup of your contact photos. It might be a chances of failure of your device or any kind any kind of incident can happen. So right now I will show you which operating system is there in my smartphone, the Xperia C5 Ultra Dual. So and which one is going to be up, updated. So let's go to the smartphone. About the phone and bottom Android version you can see that here it's Android version is 5.0 which is lollipop look at here that is lollipop and I'm going to update latest one so make sure your device is charged at least 70 percent mine is 100 percent and still it is charging using device data cable so after connecting everything, I have connected that to the system. And next step is to click on next button here. My, my camera is not highlighting contents. Okay. Next thing is there. It's showing next. Okay. So it's preparing the device. That progress bar will be here. Preparing the device. I think it is rebooting the device. Yes, device is I think in the power of mode. So now next 
information bar dial box is there for for my situation there was in my condition there was Sony Xperia C5 Ultra Dual Ultra Dual and which is ready to be updated once the next button will be pressed then installation will begin it's saying like that so not for a minute oh, that's not important right now so there is the next button at the bottom of that Xperia campaign ok go for next so that's showing installation progress bar installing update look at this so what the notice is there look at the important do not disconnect your Xperia at this point if you do so your device will no longer available for it so keep in mind on that all the important dial box which is at the bottom of the Xperia campaign you should read it and you should follow it so installing will take some time because new update and new OS is maybe more than previous OS capacity of the file maybe in the gigabytes because for getting downloaded from the Xperia server it approximately take 3 hours to me in India I don't know what is the reason of it because of my network or anything else so let it be continue guys the installation is completed now it is guiding to me one disconnect your device and second turn on your device note that the first startup after an update may take a while okay so now it is time to done it So I will disconnect the phone from the computer and we'll try to start the device. It is uh, optimizing app 22 or top 222 good number so this optimization of android app will take some time as they have said everything is ready right now my device is completely done the optimization of applications as well as updation of the operating system so now it's time to unlock and check it what happened right now so just to unlock your device if you have any locking priority or something like that and just go to the setting so applications look good I'm seeing some search application new search bar right top of the screen and uh, this one new application is loaded Xperia transfer and all all is up to date go to the setting and in the setting at the bottom of the screen you will see one minute Screen is not able to see. Okay, you will see the about the phone, and there you can see Android version. Android EM is there. I did the successful update out of Android EM. That's all. Thank you very much for watching this video. So this technique can be applicable for any device of Xperia smartphone. Awesome. Yeah.